Well, it didn't take very long for Donald Trump's team of lawyers to file an appeal again Judge McAfee's ruling that Fannie Willis can stay on the case against Donald Trump and his associates. According to Channel 11 News, the appeal has been filed because Trump's lawyers are not very pleased with the judge's decision, and they are asking for an immediate appeal on the ruling. Let's take a listen to the reporting from 11 Alive News. As you come on to the page, don't forget to hit that like bell and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so as yet. Thank you. Just in the last hour, attorneys for former President Donald Trump and several of his co-defendants asking Fulton County Judge Scott McAfee for official permission to immediately appeal Friday's disqualification ruling. And that ruling allowed District Attorney Fonnie Willis to stay on the case as long as Special Prosecutor Nathan Wade stepped down. But attorneys for the former president and his co-defendants say they aren't satisfied. They say Willis should have been removed too. And now they are asking for permission to make that argument to Georgia's appeals court. 11 Alive's Grace King explains how this could affect the timeline of the case. The issue with the appeal is whether the case goes on in the meantime behind the scenes. On Monday, a new motion asking Judge Scott McAfee to allow for an immediate review of his disqualification order. Attorneys for the former president and seven others say the judge's decision is one of exceptionally great importance. Where ensuring the appellate courts have the opportunity to weigh in on these matters pre-trial is paramount. Is the issue so big that the case literally can't proceed at trial until it has been ruled upon by the Court of Appeals? Criminal defense attorney Joshua Schiffer tells 11 Alive that McAfee must decide whether to let the defendants appeal now or later. He can basically say, go appeal this later. It's not something that actually affects this case. It's something that's important. It's something we need to go into. It's something that needs to be explored. But the needs of trying this case now outweigh the importance of what could happen to it later. Schiffer says the judge could approve this motion or deny it based on the number of other appeals expected in a case of this magnitude. There's a strong argument for efficiency's sake that we should just put all of those appeals together after a trial rather than trying to piecemeal these complicated issues one by one in advance of a trial because that would push the trial back months and or years. In Fulton County, Grace King, 11 Alive News. So we were all expecting an appeal on this case, so it's not a surprise to most of us that the appeal was filed today, so we are going to see what Judge McAfee's ruling will be whether they can appeal it immediately or later because an immediate appeal will hold up the trial. As you leave the page, don't forget to hit the like bell if you haven't done so coming on to the page and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so as yet. Thank you for watching.